This is Brenda from Cottontail Farms and today I did my very first yarn hop. And if you haven't done a yarn hop either, what it is is when a lot of a few local yarn stores get together and do an event. Um, and the idea is you travel from yarn shop to yarn shop and visit and check out the wonderful yarns and uh, buy things that you can't resist. So today was fun. It was the Sonoma County Yarn Hop. And um, of course, uh, one of the things you get with your little entrance fee, which is very nominal, is this wonderful bag. It's got rabbits on it, so how can you resist? And I started at Fiber Circle Studios, and it is a very cute little shop. And um, it's a beautiful studio. It's got all kinds of, um, and they hold all kinds of classes from uh, weaving to to spinning to dyeing uh, and that sort of thing and and um, and it was a lot of fun it was a very pretty shop and they had a lot of little vendors out in the back and so I got to visit with those um, and there were um, a great weather, le leather working group and um, alpaca group from up north and Robin from Meridian Jacobs was there <coughs> with her um, Jacob uh, fleece and yarn and um, and a little tiny preview of what she will probably be teaching at Lambtown and uh, so and if you haven't had a chance to to meet her or take a class from her it's definitely worth it so anyway at the uh, fiber circle studios what you get and I guess you would it at all of them with um, with your uh, little goodie bag was some stitched stoppers from Coco Knits, which is awesome. You can always use those. And um, some cable needles, which ironically I needed it because I couldn't find mine. And I ended up buying them at a later a later shop and I didn't know they were in the goodie bag, but um, that's okay because you can't have too many. And the next thing they had is Castaway, um, Castaway Wool Wash which is fantastic. So I'm, I'm anxious to, uh, to use that because I certainly have things to wash. Oh, and I was really excited about this. The little leather notebook and whoops, it's handmade. And the, the gal that uh, teaches how to do this is actually, um, I think she's out of that yarn shop. I think she's out of the Fiber Circle Studios, but um, she was very, very sweet, and they have classes on this, and she also has classes on um, weaving, which I thought was awesome. Um, there is a little Pearls of Joy scissors, which you can't have too many of those. And let's see, the uh, yarn hopper button. How cool is that? I didn't know that was in there. That's awesome. And these adorable little wood buttons. And I, aren't those cute? I probably can't see. Oh, one little says handmade on it. And handmade with love. Those are adorable. So that was all in the goodie bag that just for attending um, for paying the small entrance fee and attending the event. So, and, and like I say, it was just fun. Um, another one I visited, the next one on, on the thing was Castaway Yarn Shop. Oh, and I forgot to mention that um, you get a free pattern with every place you stop. So in this one um, was the Fiber Circle Studios and it was a painted points shawl. I probably should have taken pictures of each of them, but um, but it was very pretty. Um, and the next one I visited was Castaway Yarn Shop. And that is a, uh, a cute little yarn shop. And they also have, um, they had two, they had for crochet and knitting, two shawls. And from them, I managed to buy this really wonderful, I'm going to mispronounce it, Sueño by Haiku. I probably killed that name, but you get the idea. It's uh, merino and bamboo. And this one is mud puddle. 
and this one is Shifting Sands. And I'm taking a class from Craftsy on doing a Mobius. And this is um, going to be perfect for that because it's a two color Mobius. And um, I think it's going to be a really pretty contrast of the two colors. It's kind of, it's an accordion. And um, I think it's going to be really nice, <clears throat> especially for fall with the browns with fall. Um, the next place I visited was Yarnitudes. And they were um, such nice people. Oh my gosh. But, um, and they had their shawl, which I ended up buying the little, um, how cute is that? The little packet for the yarn that went with it. The shawl was really cute. And I just thought this, this yarn was awesome. So I, I wish you could feel it, but um, it is was specially made for them, universal yarn. And it was made for um, made for yarnitudes, and it's bamboo and cotton. And one is a um, this kind of speckled, and one is purple, and they go together and make this really pretty two-tone shawl. And I don't know if I'm going to do the shawl, but I am going to use them together because they go together so well. Um, so that was yarnitudes. And the last place I visited, oh, what else did I get? Oh, I also got, oh, I forgot, from Yarnitudes um, was this, and I already cast on the other one, so, um, was um, Vintage Wave, which is a merino nylon, and I'm doing a, um, a drop stitch shawl, and so I think this will be perfect. Um, so then Pearls of Joy. And they had their A Girl's Best Friend shawl, which was very cute. And I bought, I didn't buy the yarn that goes with it, but not only were they having their specials there, but they were having a 10% off. So I bought a lot. Um, so this I got for a, um, for another cowl that I have set up to do. And it's, um, Cascade Yarn Heritage Silk, and it's merino and silk. And they actually had, I bought, I haven't bought Cascade in a while, but there was a, um, a, a representative from Cascade Yarns there. And so um, I like what he was saying, and, and uh, he was very, um, answered questions from all the, all the shoppers and had a demo station there and I know that they're, um, so he, he was, he was, um, answered a lot of questions and was very helpful. And so I thought, well, we'll, we'll give them a second chance here and, and see how it goes. So, um, so I thought this was very, very pretty. It's a, um, sock weight. And I think it's going to be really perfect for, um, for the cowl I had in mind. And then I also picked up, um, their Luminosa yarn, let me put that out there. And um, it's uh, viscose, baby alpaca, and merino wool, wool. And it's got a sheen, you can't, I don't know if you can tell, but it's got a really pretty sheen to it. And that was the one thing I don't know what I'm gonna do with quite yet, but it, um, I told myself I wasn't gonna buy something I don't have a pattern for, but apparently I did. And um, Tahiki Yarns from Alden, which is a merino, super fine and acrylic. And I really liked, I'm gonna do um, another cowl. I guess I'm on a cowl kick. I'm gonna do another cowl, um, which is a, a seed stitch cowl. And um, I think it's gonna be really nice. And I wanted a very simple yarn and something that was very, had um, a nice hand to it. It was very comfortable. And something that didn't have a lot of um, change in colors because I want the stitch definition. I want the stitch to be what really stands out, not the, um, not the yarn itself. And the very last thing I picked up was um, Comfort and Joy called Bunny Love, which um, is, or it's Mirth. I think Comfort and Joy might be the dyer. 
um, is BFL in nylon, and it's specifically made for the 2018 Sonoma County yarn hop. And it's in the so, and that was almost gone. I think I got the second to the last skein. So, um, I was pretty happy about that. And I love the colors. It's a sock weight, and I'm sure that I have a lot of things that go with it. So, and um, oh, other than my other more cable things, because I didn't know we were getting them. But it's it's awesome. So it's just it's a little coats. Um, company um, package and it just has the um, the hook the cable yarn hook bigger one and then the little tiny um, crochet hook for picking up stitches so that'll, that'll be really good in a little bag um, a little project bag so that was all of the um, wonderful little um, free patterns and a great day up in uh, Sonoma checking out uh, all the little yarn shops and all the great yarn and meeting all the absolutely lovely people that are up there and uh, it was really a really great day I'm looking forward to doing it next year thanks bye bye